Hello everyone, it is Rose and Hunter doing things. Hello. Today, it is my husband, Hunter Doington's 44th birthday. Wow, happy birthday, honey. Thanks, Rose. You're welcome. Rose? Suzanne, hi! Hi, how have you been? Oh, starting to get better and move past mom. I mean, I still can't believe she's gone sometimes. I know, that's probably very hard to accept. It's been a year since my dad passed, and the first year is always the hardest, I think. He pa It's been actually over a year. He died on March 3rd, so... <sighs> yep. Oh my god. So, how's your new place? Oh, it's, it's good, actually. We've already met the neighbors and have made some friends already. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we have. It's really nice. We just thought we'd go on a walk today because Hunter's off from work, so... I took the day off too, so yeah. How are your daughters, Miley and Alyssa? They're good. Miley's um in her last year of grade eight. I can't believe it. Does she like her new school? Yeah, she does. <laughs> and our other and Alyssa's doing well too in her new school. That's good. Yeah. Well, I better get going. Speaking of school, I have some work. I have to go to work, but I'll see you guys later. Bye. 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 Oh no. What? She just left, but Suzanne forgot to close her garage. Should we close it up for her? I don't know if she has a passcode or not. Tell you what, Rose, let's go on a walk first and then come back and worry about her garage, because I'm sure it's a safe neighborhood. Okay. I mean, there can't be anything too valuable in there, can't it? Hopefully not. I mean, look at their yard across the street from them. They have an open carport. They don't have a garage yet. No. Oh my god. What? It's so weird seeing, like, a brand new house like this. I know, it's crazy. I just can't believe there's a pool here. I know, right, Samantha? Crazy. And Samantha, here's a old house. Uh, whoa. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> oh my god. Hunter, look at this. They have a Porsche. Oh my god, look at it, it's so cool, and the house, I mean it looks the exact same, but oh my god, yep, I guess they got a Porsche. And like, look at the neighborhood, I mean there's a brand new house across from us, and for sale, oh my god, and this house looks empty too, there's no one here, no car home, crazy. Probably a lot of people are at, are at work close. I know. Oh my gosh. The street's changing so much. I know. Well, since we saw it all, should we head back towards Suzanne's? Sure. Here it is. I mean, there's no one home. Should we just try to close the garage door? Sure. Okay, I'll try to figure out how to close it from in here. Okay. Boop. Oh no. What? I pressed the button. What button? I don't know what it does. Ah! ah! <laughs> Hunter, what do we do? We're stuck inside our cars! I don't know, I mean, hopefully this back door's open, otherwise we're just we're kind of stuck in here. I know, oh my god! <laughs> it's okay, well. Is it 9 30 in the morning and we're stuck inside of garage? I know, Samantha. What are we supposed to do? I don't know what we're supposed to do. I mean, we probably just have to wait. Hopefully, they get home soon. I mean, I mean, it's a little bit claustrophobic in here. I know, that's, that's what I'm thinking. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa, it's okay. <laughs> so loud! I know, it's just kind of a funny scenario that, like, I'm stuck inside our good neighbor's garage. I know! <laughs> Hopefully there's a way out. Yeah. A few hours later. Rose, like, you're sure we shouldn't try to unlock the door? I mean, the back door. 
Hunter that goes into Suzanne's house. I mean, I know that we she wouldn't mind if we like went inside, I'm sure. But their maid is here and she wouldn't really know who we are. She would probably recognize us. We've gone to Suzanne's neighborhood barbecues and neighborhood stuff. Yeah, but it's not like we've been at her house every day for her to know who we are. She might think we're trying to break in. And besides, Suzanne probably would have told her if we were, she was having visitors. Yeah. Oh my god. But Rose, it's unlocked, I think. Let me try. See, Rose, it is unlocked. But Hunt, we shouldn't go into her house. Oh, what time is it? One thirty-six. Oh, dude, I will be home soon. One hour later. Should I go to the front door or the garage? Uh, front door. No, he went to the front door. Hi, maid. Hi, dear. I'm just getting ready. I mean, gonna get do something. I mean, like getting ready for my work. What? Never mind. Um, so dear, I've heard some noises coming from your garage, but I don't didn't want to investigate because I was too nervous. Why do you say that? I don't know, I was just nervous. I heard, like, voices, but it's probably just inside my head. <coughs> Wait, did you hear that? Yeah. I think there's someone in my garage. <sighs> okay. I will save them. Oh my goodness. Okay, if it's an intruder, I have my little weapon. Boop. Hi! Wolves? Hunter? <sighs> Dude, thank God we're out of there. What's going on? What are you guys doing in my garage randomly today? It's a long story. So we saw that your when Susan we saw Suzanne this morning once she left for work. Yeah. And we saw she forgot to close your garage door. And I don't think anyone else was home, right? Well, not yet not the time. I mean the triplets had already went to school and I was I've been at work for a few hours already. So then we went to Suzanne's house and we, I mean, no, we went into the garage and then we were stuck. Why don't you just go through the front door? We could have, you could have came out that way. Well, but the maid doesn't know us, really, so I'm sure she would have recognized you guys. You guys would have to wait for me to get home. <sighs> Thank God we're out of the Dildarian. Well, since you're here, do you guys want to stay for a visit? I mean, Suzanne gets home soon, so. Sure, but Alyssa and Miley, they can walk home now. Sure, I'll just send, give her a call. Okay, let's go inside through the house. Ah, oh, Darren, thank you so much for inviting us inside. Well, of course, you had to sit in my garage for four hours now, so it's the least I can do for you. Yeah. Soon. <sighs> Darren! <sighs> I'll just, I'll go inside and tell him. Darren, you know what time it is, Carl Slop a doodle Oh. Rose? Hunter, what are you guys doing here? Hi, Samantha. I mean, <laughs> Suzanne, sorry. Hi. Um, I made an interesting discovery when I got home from work today. What? Rose and Hunter were trapped in our garage. What? Oh my god. How did that happen? I swear I closed the garage. You didn't, Suzanne. So then Hunter and I... Well, after you left, we decided to close the garage, but couldn't figure out how. So then we went inside the garage, and then Hunter accidentally pressed the button from the inside, I think, and then it closed the garage. And we did, couldn't open it because you can only open the garage with the button, right? Yeah, um, that's true. Can, and I was the one that had the door closer. So then what, is that an open button for the garage? Yeah. So, I mean, well, it closes too, but, so I have the opener button, but you have to press the button to close it, and there's, the button's only in my car, so, and there, oh my gosh, it's confusing, but yeah. But the point was, you guys were trapped inside the garage and you couldn't get out. Yes. 
Oh my god, you must be starving. Don't worry, Darren, I already took care of that. We've had snacks and stuff. Oh my god, guys. Well, I'm so sorry that wasn't supposed to happen. I feel terrible. It's okay, Suzanne. But fortunately, we should probably get going. We have some kids to collect from school soon. Okay, yeah. Well, it was so nice seeing you guys. Yeah, you as well. Take care, and please, next time you come, don't come through the garage. <laughs> we won't. Bye.